Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Yvonne Hodrul, mother of many, oh so many. And last episode we took a big chunk of land and that put us quite a bit above our domain limit. So we're gonna have to give some of these away and I'm thinking we're gonna give it to some of our children that won't inherit the entirety of our kingdom. So I figured we can just go and sort by our dynasty and we can give this to you. That's good. And that gave away the temple district as well, which is good. And you can have that one. Unfortunately, we can't give it to our daughters, which seems unfair, but that's that's how this works. And you're zero years old. But we gotta give it to someone, and you'll grow into it. Don't worry. And then we have Ackle. Ackle. Who are you? Why are you here? Son of Court Chaplain. You are quite disfigured, I see. That's all right. Okay, um, I guess the last one isn't going to a hard rule. Because, uh, well, our heir is getting enough stuff, so he don't need it. But we could give it to... Who are you? You're unlanded. And you're our marshal. Oh, you should definitely get... Oh, you're a powerful vassal. You should probably probably be our marshal, actually. He is a little bit better. Oh, wait. But our marshal is a powerful vassal. Hmm. How's your spycraft? Not great. Huh. Okay, well, I guess he just gets to be sulky then. And we won't give him more stuff. You, however, is pretty good. Oh, wait, you are someone else's marshal. That makes sense. Okay, well, now you're my vassal and champion. Excellent. Oh, speaking of champions, um, we have a lot of prestige and we still haven't got any of the werewolf scouting parties, which is, well, I think it's probably the strongest buildi building in the werewolf... Uh, well, building tree, I guess. Um, I mean, we do need the money stuff, so I have been prioritizing that because we can't afford a lot of our levies, so I kind of have to prioritize our money a little bit. But we are going to plop that down in all of our stuff. There we go. Does the upgrade give two? It does. Yeah, so we're definitely going to want that, but what do we need for it? Um... Okay, it just needs to be less than 10 development. That is easily achieved. All except here, but we can always get the building that just lowers uh, development. Although, I kind of want the money here, because uh, more money means we can have more, more levies up at the same time. And I realized we were done with the religion there, so I want to convert this place, because right now... We have an evil religion here, and we can't have that, so let's get rid of that. And right, there was one more thing I wanted to do before we get going. We have a lot of prisoners, and I feel like we gotta get rid of some of these because we just have a lot of them, and I don't know what to do with them. So first of all, let's just ransom anyone that, give us, that can give us money, like so. Oh, all oh, right, we were marrying off our daughters. Excellent. He accepts. And he accepts. So that's another... Well, that's first of all 20 gold. Because of ransom. And it should have given us two more... Or at least one more alliance. I think the other ones we kind of already had. But this one is new. Which actually is kind of really weak. But I thought they had some champions. Oh, well, whatever. That's fine. Um, with the money we can get we'll i think we're just gonna execute all the vampires but we only have two but those are gonna be good executions so we'll burn her because it's not a ty it's not tyranny if they're evil so burn her and uh, the other one you we will we will behead you excellent hey i cut that off mm. The rest, 
Oh, we do have a revenant. So we could. I mean, even though it's a game, it feels wrong executing a baby. So let's just ransom her. It's fine. We'll grab a favor or whatever. It just, it just feels wrong. So the rest of you, we're going to demand a conversion and recruit you. Because you might not be... No, that's not what how we're doing it. Um, they might not be great, but you never know. They might turn up uh, turn up to be um, to be um, useful. So let's just go through these. Oh, we already did you grab you and you. Oh wait. Oh, I guess you're already part of our court. So. I guess demand, can we? No. Demand conversion. And demand conversion and recruit. There we go. So, now we can unpause. We gain a hook and we're re releasing a bunch of people. Although, while we're doing that, I want to go raiding again. But we don't have anything to raid close to us because we've either conquered it or we've already raided it. And we do have a lot of strong people around us. Although, we can probably conquer you. But yeah, you're strong and you're strong, so they can actually muster stuff to kill our raiding party. So, I think it's time we grab a boat. And yeah, we can grab you and let's grab a couple more in the surrounding area. Because we're gonna go pretty far. That's not everything, is it? Huh. Uh, it's, oh, actually, that was that was a pretty good amount. So, yeah, grab those as well. Okay. I guess uh, none of these were really fully charged, but that's all right. Let's collect everyone over here. Actually, we should get rid of the wolves, though. Although, they, will s they won't cost this much once they're raiding. And they're... I guess they're pretty all right. Yeah, let's just grab them, I guess. They can come. It's fine. And a child of my dynasty. Excellent. Another grandchild. Oh, and I realized why she looks like this. It's uh, not because of, uh, like, like she's a lupus or whatever. Uh, it's because she's in one of the other forms. Because only the, I guess it's a Krios form. That is the actual werewolves. The others are like human wolf hybrid ish that we actually they still actually look kind of human but with wolf features but tyke is fine hmm. okay you need to hurry the hell up there we go grab all of you and i will leave this um oh that's 40 oh yeah uh what do we have here that's 39 that's pretty nice Basically looking at capitals, we can go, yeah, that's 27, 28, yeah, we can get some good stuff. But let's start with Estonia, then we'll go over to Österjötland, and probably Småland. Hey, a new generation, we get another werewolf from nowhere. The, the wolf's population of, of your area has recently experienced a hands, handful of first change among them. As is the duty of any self-serving tribe, you have been scouting for those lost pups and brought them, brought the most deserving home with you. After a time of adaptation needed to teach those lupus the ways of the world beyond their forest, they are now ready to become fully fledged members of your pack. So we get Ingbjörg of Aarhus, and well, you're not a great character. The learning isn't bad, and the prowess—you're a good champion, but. And a decent learning, I guess. But the rest is kind of mediocre. But you'll be fine. I'm glad to have you. Because that's another champion that is about 40 prowess. Yes, look at these. <laughs> oh, you're strong. And you're a berserker. We should probably land you. Although you're 44, but you're a werewolf. So you'll live into your like 80s and 90s. No problem. So, yeah. Okay, let's speed this up so we can... Oh. <laughs> so we can get there, but... I guess uh, land on their army. But that's alright. Are, are you raiding? 
You better get the hell out of there. So, lines about legacy. The latest work of my foe Duke Andreas Andreasen has become all the rage at court of late. The piece deals with memory and what we leave behind, and Andreas Andreasen has publicly dedicated it to me. Old foe, I thought we became friends. Oh, gross, you're a Malkavian. I thought you were a werewolf. Okay, uh, oh right, you're the leader of, no, yes, the northern Norway people, these guys, right. Because he did a bunch of, like, friend stuff to us. That was weird. A la uh, lament for war lady. What, a, what woman does not hope to rest when tired, no matter her wealth and treasure acquired? Tis rare enough for women to admit that given chance they'd changed quite a bit. So far I kept my thoughts to myself, but the buzz has been growing too dramatic to ignore for much longer. Why would there be such a buzz over a really small piece of poetry that's... Not that good, but oh, we can make him a little bit mad and gain uh, prestige. Yeah, let's let's roll for the prestige. I want the prestige. I don't know quite how to feel about this, and he'll be humiliated, just like I like it. Yeah, yeah. end it. Oh, we got a banner. Excellent. I love getting banners. Oh, that's a really good one too. That's more dread, more knights, and a little bit of court grandeur. Excellent. I survey the battlefield, contemplating how this battle will be remembered, and gaze towards the dead that remain. I notice a group of my soldiers approaching, and they politely bow before me. My lady, we come upon the enemy banner while we were cleaning the battlefield. We thought it would be a shame to leave it behind. Perhaps you wish to keep it as a trophy. No, we'll definitely keep this. That is a very good banner. Oh, we're back inside. I guess it's... I don't know if it's because of development or court grandeur or what, but... I'm glad that we're inside, honestly, because the um, court events hasn't been working. So, yeah. I kind of want to stay inside. But we are... Rating, we have a lot of a lot of room for stuff. We might just go and grab some other stuff while we're here, like in there and yeah, I guess there. We raid pretty fast. Yeah. Although our super fast raiding buff did go away a while ago, I think. Because it only lasted like no wait. It lasted twenty years, I think. So it probably went away really recently. Because uh, wait, we start at 12.30. Yeah, so it's only been gone for like 13 years. No, three years, I mean. So, yeah. Let's go grab this. There we go. Beautiful. So, let's go to Sudder Shipping. Got a nice little cache of money. No one's raiding us, right? No. No, this is our raiding. That's not others raiding us. Hey, another grandchild. Excellent. And Yvonne is a beautiful name. I will accept them naming her after me. Excellent. Boiling anger. You might be a war lady, but you're also an abhorrent doxy. <laughs> oh, that's fighting words. Oh, you don't want to be on my bad side. The unprovoked anger expressed by my courtier Sunjar uh, comes as a complete surprise. She has been under a lot of stress lately, but to behave like this... That... even she struggles. It's calmly... calming. But now I kind of just want to... beat her up, but fine. We can be the bigger woman. And... Ooh, they have some heavy infantry. Not that powerful characters. Yeah, so I definitely think we win this. More gra this is gonna pop up a lot, especially since we uh, started getting our children at age. Hey, it's Gurley. Uh, we just named the grandchild Yvonne. That's gonna be very, very uh, um, confusing. So, Ingrithr is fine. Although they did break us down to our to our champions, so. Stop attacking me, please. You're... 
Okay, we don't have any more room. Um, I guess go home and uh, dump this off. And while we're here, we might just... Okay, we need to start getting rid of some banners, I think. But let's uh, raise some local raiders. You can go down there and collect. There we go. And let's go to Småland. Oh yeah, that's that's a good place. And once again, they're pretty strong, but we can handle ourselves. Oh, empty. Oh, I guess our spy master died. Um, any powerful vassals that needs... Well, do we need a good spy master? It would be nice to get him on our good side. And we don't it's not like we have any amazing spy masters. We have an eleven, but eh. Let's just go with the with the uh, fill the council uh, with people that like us. And can we shuffle these around? Like what's your skill? You're well you're actually a really good marshal. You're a good no, okay, we're a you're a better over there you're an excellent diplomat though so let's shuffle these two yes yeah, swap those get a little bit more steward and much more in chancellor which is good you didn't have no you were the same you're pretty garbage yeah so that's a little bit better good to have a, a look at that every now and then and how's our building coming along did it finish? No, almost. So, we can upgrade it for another one. But that is a lot. And we can upgrade that, but that's also a lot. Um, okay, yeah, we are in the capital. Okay, yeah, let's go for another night. And you can start... No, wait, you already... You're already doing the this one. So, let's just have a look at this. Yeah, they're attacking, but we'll beat that easily. You need the night building. There we go. Just so I don't forget. We finished raiding. We got a nice amount of money. Your inland stuff isn't that great. Although, there's 17 there. It's not nothing. Raid or trade. As my troops and I prepare to sack the lands of Möre, our first scouts report back. It seems the local towns are rich, but many are heavily fortified, and we could well be caught out by vengeful armies before we can break into the juiciest targets. All is not lost. The art of good raiding is all in exploiting opportunity, and we could perhaps arrange a trade and tribute in exchange for staying our blades. No. Continued ra raiding. And... It's a nine in both of these, so we could pop over there. Yeah, I'm not very threatened by this. We do still have a nice amount of raiding room. Fire and blood. The settlement of, of Borgholm, an important stronghold in great, Greater Erland, has fallen to my raiders. We have the run of the vast tracts of land and many of the quivering subjects, sh uh, shining treasures of devotee Arnulf Jormungandrson. That is a long name. <laughs> Uh, to choose from. The troops stand ready, awaiting for my command to give them direction. Uh, we don't want slaves, because that will give us give us uh, development. But we can definitely give us some bounteous plunder. So, let's just grab this and then go home, because we're already full up. Dallas, oh, Dalla comes of age. I'm proud to see my daughter is no longer a child. She's an adequate bargainer. Well, it's pretty alright. They grow up so fast, though. Oh, damn hiccups. Why have I... St I've started getting hiccups while I record. It's very annoying. <laughs> hey, pack training. Training time. So. Um, we could spar a little bit. Uh, we can... We can uh, crack down on the development a little bit, which wouldn't be bad. We get some prowess and dread, but we lose a bunch of taxes, and I want my taxes. Because that's a lot of money. And we can't get a bunch of experience. I do think I like the experience, but I think I want the breed experience. 
How's our stress? Yeah, we're fine on stress. Oh, I can see it's not going critical by looking at that. I always forget that. But yeah, I, I think I like the breed experience. Let's go for that. Excellent. So let's go home. And that's a nice bit of money. And I think we're done raiding for now. I do think we might want to... Oh, you got... Oh, okay, you got a lot of cultists. And you got mercenaries. That's why. Because you are fighting over there. So, how's our truces? We still have one with you for 32 days. Okay, we can finish that. And... That's two years. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, 32 days. Just Let's just wait for that. Boop, 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 boop. Is that enough? I didn't see where we started. Yes, but... Oh, that's still our rating. So, let's uh, start a war. Okay. We need to get rid of some of these. I like having a lot of them around, kind of, because then you can just click wherever and get it but yeah let's get rid of some and right i actually have to declare the war but we will we can now hold a war for duchies we can take the rest of it so grab that we'll raise yeah let's raise all we can uh, disband a couple of them uh yeah let's just finish that's not all is it oh yeah it is that is yeah, that's it. that is four and a half thousand. Just felt like it wasn't enough. So get rid of you and get rid of no, no, ah, uh, crap. That's not what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. Get rid of all these very injured ones as well, because they need to go and replenish. And yeah, let's get rid of all the tattered ones and that big one. There we go. Much cheaper, and that is plenty for what we need. Hey, he learned a language. Excellent. And another grandchild. Oh, you're having lots of babies. Man, you're 24 and you already have four kids. You are... You're getting in. So, Svein is good. That's a powerful name. Excellent. So, that is... Damn it. It's hard to see if they if they have walls or not. More things. More well, I shouldn't call them things. They're our grandchildren. But we're just gonna Okay, I don't like the amount of of raiding they're or not raiding. Sieging they're doing, but that's alright. Hey, Sif is at age. So she is a is an insightful thinker. It's alright. But we have some people to to make make them marry people. There it is. Why is it? I I don't understand why it's always grayed out. So do we have any good alliances? This is internal. Okay, so these are all gonna be internal, isn't it? Yes, those are internal except for that one. But we already have an alliance with you, so. Go for relevance. No, go for age. No, go for traits. Inheritable. 23 and comely, isn't... Oh, fecund and 16. You're... I mean, it's not the greatest congenital trait, but considering the... <laughs> at the rate our... Well, we and our kids are making kids... Fecund will, she she will never not be pregnant. So if we want a big family, this is how we get it. The life expectancy is nice too, but that is something to consider. Oh, actually, Herculean, he is 28, but that's not that old. I mean, it's, it's a little bit of a big age gap if we're uh, thinking real world, but... I mean, Herculean is too good of a trait, and we want that. No, wait, that's not the guy. I like that because we can be, we can get Comely and Herculean at some of our, our grandchildren, which I like. Matrilineal, definitely. 
Excellent. And which one was that? That was, yeah, okay. So you need to marry as well. You're 16. So same thing with you, but I guess you can get the fecund guy because that's, I didn't don't think we considered any of the other, actually, Comely is nice. You are, you're already strong, which is excellent. So, hey, Comely and strong could be really good. Matrilineal, yes. Yes, I like that. We're gonna have the greatest, biggest family in the history of ever. Uh, that is internal. Inari is internal, I think. Yeah, there it is. Uh, Skolt is internal. Yeah, okay, these are all my kids. So I don't care about having an alliance with that unless there's starting to be some uh, some uh, uprisings. You might be a war lady, but you're also a vile fiend. A girly comes and cusses me out. You bastard. I'm your mother. You don't speak to me like that. But um, yeah, okay, let's let's go down and kill them. We can't have them running around, seeding everything. Oh! <laughs> uh, that was... Well, that was easy. I figured we were just gonna kill them and then go up and sieging, because I can't have them sieging everything of our stuff, but this is fine. So, we have basically all of... All of the north. I think we're gonna leave this, because... Um, they are actually werewolves, so we'll leave them be for now. If we could get an alliance with them, that would be fine, but they don't... Damn, they don't have a good luck with their with their kids. They all died at age zero. Oh, that is so sad. But they have some live kids now, which is... I mean, it's good for them. This is just sad. Yeah, we might marry some of our kids or grandkids or something to their children when they get a little bit older. Man, that's a bummer. Um, but I think we're just gonna give these... A w we can't give them to grandchildren. Yeah, I think that's good, actually. Keep them in the family. You can have one. Very young rulers, but... Hey, what what can you do? This is... <laughs> these are the people we have. They'll grow into them. That is fine. And we're back to what we want to be yet. And we finished building stuff here. We did upgrade to that. How many knights do we have now? 17. And we got really strong ones. Yeah, that is awesome. Um, yeah, we are pretty high on stuff. Can get some more money. Oh, we need to disband our army. We are making really good money now, though. And we got a good amount of prestige. Oh, we should be able to raise a runestone. Yes! Rune stones! Every rune stone, stone tells a story. Yeah, we'll pay 50, pay 50 gold for it. That is cool because we get a bunch of prestige, which means we can build more cool buildings. Now that I've decided what to put on my rune stone, the question remains where to place it. So, um, we do get, like, control growth. So, we could... I think I like putting it over here because we do need more control over it here and I think that's good I mean we could put put it in Sigivara which is is it one of those no I don't know what that is but yeah I think Lufutter is a Lefetter um is lo whatever uh, is good we'll gain a bunch of stuff we gain opinion this is good. Yes, that is. Setting up rune stones is such a good ability. It gives you so much good stuff. I love it. So, we could upgrade that, but... How much for this? 450. Yes. That is a lot. So, I think we'll spend it on, like, this one. It's just 300. 300 is good. Spend it on that. I had 600 for two more, but... We are getting up there in champions, and that's gonna be so good for fighting. 
So let's let some time pass. We're known for our dedication of, to our faith. Excellent. Paragon of Virtue will be able to declare for kingdom, I think. Hey, spouse grow fonder. To nurture a relationship between the next generation of rulers is duty. Uh, we, it's a duty we should not neglect, says Warlord Adder Apogris. Some of your inf more influential vassals have children that I am certain Ragnar would benefit of knowing. Well, that is... That is a very good point. So... Uh, that's our Chancellor. And... I guess we should do, like, someone that's really old. That they might actually... Yeah, like this guy. Because they might actually inherit stuff sooner. So, Knuter would probably be good. And it's good that our heir has a bunch of powerful friends so yeah excellent i like that and demand oh yeah you're gonna be dead soon so you're not gonna get it back i am gonna decline but i really like uh queen Luhi. she is such a cool character and i have been uh, like considering playing some campaign with her because uh, well first of all she's a malkavian which I really like Malkavians. I can't believe I haven't played one yet. But she's a really cool character because, um, first of all, she is pretty old. She is pretty powerful. But she uh, she is basically a minion of uh, the uh, the antediluvian La Sombra. Like the La Sombra antediluvian. And she has like this, this incredibly like comic book mustache twirly villainous plot of blotting out the sun which is just awesome especially for a vampire that they just wanna like kill the sun and i just think that's just awesome so i like her but we are 100 percent gonna like take her shit soon so i don't care what she demands uh, there's just 10 months left of that truce so we're just gonna wait for that to end and okay you are still in this war you're in debt i think we are declaring on you we're gonna grab all of jemtland yes definitely there might be some people join maybe we go for the your duchy but this is, yeah, this is just one barony. Because the entirety of the duchy is, yeah, it's part of this. Right, that's why we have it. Yeah, I'm okay with other people potentially joining in. We have our own alliances that might join in so, or that we can call, so that's fine. And we don't need that, but we do have a perk. So first of all, Let's get that. A bunch of opinion from all of our all of our culture and different culture. So everyone basically. And uh, I think we're gonna switch this to I think we're going for tribal gifts because I do recall some of these being pretty good. Yeah, defender advantage is I mean it's fine. Natural dread is fun, dread gain is fun, prowess is good, same faith opinion is good. Injury resistance is pretty nice. House opinion is pretty alright. Oh, this one is also pretty cool. Each werewolf parent, grandparent, and great grandparent adds strength of ancestor. So if if it's like far down the line of a vampire, this will be like a big buff. So that's really cool. So I think we're gonna go down this tree now. Gives us some prowess, and we don't have to deal with the or Oh, wait, that's negative stress gain. Never mind. I thought it was an extra st stress. But um, we can also work off some stress, which we are going to do. Let's go. It's sometimes hard to find the motivation to remain consistent when exercising by myself. I could try to find myself a partner who then would not only motivate me on bad days, but would also be someone that I can compare myself to when, tr when tracking my own progress. Which makes sense. What kind of companion should sh suit me the most? Someone I can look up to, someone to keep me on my toes, or perhaps someone I know should be, uh, I should never aspire to be. 
Oh, um, wait, really? Watching Ragnar's, watching my son struggle would be motivating. What the shit? But I mean, I like the chance of becoming friends. That's, that's always good. Good to have th my kids on my good side. So yeah. And he becomes athletic, which is oh so, uh, or did it say could become athletic? Either way, it's good. So let's raise. No, wait, we still haven't declared. <laughs> I keep getting distracted. Of Jemtland. Oh, they have some stuff down there as well, but that's fine. Ooh, we should save up some money to make a holy order. That would be cool. So raise everyone there. Um, yeah, we are gonna get rid of some because that is too much money. Uh, get rid of you because you're not full. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you because you're expensive. There we go. And get rid of you and you and you. No. And you and you. Because you're expensive. And... Get rid of you, 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 and you. And you, I guess. That's okay. Okay, that's not a lot of money spent. And now we can just go and collect ourselves here. What are they fighting for? Defending against blah, blah, blah in the Holy War for the count county of Jemtland. Which is this. Okay. That's all right. We're going to go and take that so they don't grab it. Actually, split. One of you go over there. One of you go and take that. And yeah, you're... I mean, you're a really strong army, but so is this because all of our champions are so strong. Like both of these armies are really strong as is, which is excellent. Loving it. I mean, I knew that werewolves was gonna be strong in the like champion division, but I didn't think they were gonna be this strong just on the fact that they just have so many babies. So they create champions like nobody's business, which is awesome, by the way. And actually, do we have any? No, you. You seem to be the better one. It is mostly raid stuff. And we are getting into winter, so... Advantage pro in provinces of winter, which is good. So, I don't care that you're gonna take a little bit of attrition. You can stand there and siege. These can come and help if need be, but... I mean, the... The prediction is good for us. But we can just station some besiegers and go and help. Just in case. And yeah, that was really easy. So, excellent. That was quick and easy. And they seem to have ended their war as well. Uh, we could just go straight into the next one if we wanted to. But I think we'll hold off on that. We might just do it because, well, we absolutely can. And they don't have anyone, like, super strong. But it is time to end this. And all of these episodes just turn out really long. Because I just, I just lose track of time. Because the werewolves are so much fun to play. And I forgot how fun it is to have just children. Because they give another dimension of the of the game. And it's been so long since I played a character that can have children. <laughs> so, yeah. I hope you're enjoying the series. If you enjoyed it, consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.